Hi, I'm Elian. This is my synthesizer, which I called Wupa, and uh, despite I haven't done much changes since last demo, I want to share another video where I will explain how it works, its workflow, and uh, its main features. So I just switched it on, and uh, we need to wait for maybe 30 seconds for it to load, because it's operating Linux, you can see Raspberry Pi Zero here. And I cleaned it as much as possible, but it's still not bare metal, it's Linux. Okay, so we are now on the main screen, on the default instrument. And I will press this button to record everything that comes to my headphones. So you will hear the same audio that I hear right now. And uh, yeah, we are on default instrument. You can switch octave here. It's a instrument called SIMP because it's a simple sine wave with ADSR. Uh, yeah, to switch instrument you need to press shift and let's say C-sharp, a combination of buttons. Here is a mic, mic input. input, here is a mic itself. Uh, some synthesizer, one voice synthesizer named Singleton. Uh, drum kit. Guitar sampler. Uh, Rolls sampler, some mallet, and bass. If you have musical ear, you probably notice that I press uh, buttons and sound is not uh, on the same note that I press. It's because Wupa operates scale. Uh, we can switch to another screen with combination of buttons and see Mixolydian. So, if you are smart enough, you can change it to chromatic. But I'm not, and I will select harmonic minor. And yeah, here we go. So, to loop something, you need to press one of these keys, um, which represents uh, different loops. Uh, there are four loops in this synthesizer. So, I will loop bass first, and then add some drums and whatever. So, let's start. Yeah, here is my first loop. You may notice that it's blinking blue. Uh, and here is a small dot, which means that it's now in, uh, is in uh, overdub mode. I press it again, and now it's green, and here is a small triangle, which means that it's in playback mode. So let's add some drums to another loop. Loops are synced uh, with, with uh, the first one, but they may be not the same length. Uh, it's not necessary. So let's add some guitar maybe yeah, and uh, make it longer. Now we have three layers of sound. We may switch to the second screen and add some effects. Uh, actually, there are uh, th there can be technically uh, any effects, but now it's only reverb. I will add some reverb to guitar and to bass. Uh, maybe for two, two drums also. And uh, now we can, for example, mute something, or unmute something, or add more layers, for example, with this one voice synthesizer. It's not recorded on loop, it's recorded in file actually, as I record everything that is playing on master track. Uh, 
Yeah, and uh, later I will just uh, copy this track via web interface and insert in the video. So basically that's it. Uh, if you have some thoughts uh, on how it can be evolved and uh, which uh, what it should become, uh, please leave comments and uh, give some feedback. I will be happy. <laughs>